called the professionals are making so much money, but who's made the most in their career? Face Simp, Optics Company, and Face of are some of the highest paid Call of Duty pros in the world, but where's that money coming from? How's it split up? And most importantly, who has the most of it? We'll be looking at the land earnings of Face Simp, Optics Company, and Face of BZ, taking into account their major tournament winnings, invitationals, and special one-off events. Subscribe so you don't miss more esports salary breakdowns on my channel, all informed by esportsearnings.com. Christopher Lear, aka Sim, aka Simp the Sick Joe, aka Simp the Pimp, multi Call of Duty champion. The man's brought home a bag, okay? Let's add it up. In 2016, online in Black Ops 3, Simp brought home $1,625 from one tournament, and that was 0.12% of the total prize money earned. That year in land, he didn't bring back anything. 2017, online, he brought home $3,500 from two tournaments, and that was 0.25% of the total prize pool that year. Two first places, one in Infinite Warfare and one in World War II. In 2018, online, he brought home $2,120 from four tournaments. He got four first places that year. Pretty impressive, you know? All in Black Ops 4. 2019 is when he finally got his first year on land. That year, he brought home $285,500 from six tournaments, and that was 20.71% of the total prize money that year. And he won his first CWL championship or a ring in Black Ops 4. Pretty typical. 2020 online, he brought home $283,708 from 14 tournaments, and that was 17.14% of the total prize money that year, bringing home multiple first places in the online portion of this year. That year, 2020 on land, he brought home $12,000 from two tournaments, and that was 0.86% of the total prize money that year. 2021 online, he brought home $146,000 from five tournaments, and that was 10.48% of the total prize money earned, bringing home first places again, some back-to-back, -back, even getting a 3 P online. On land in 2021, he got 352500 from three tournaments, and that was a quarter of the prize pool, a little bit more, two first places, including another ring that year in Black Ops Cold War. They were very dominant that year. In 2022 online, Sim brought home 2500 from one tournament. That year on land, he brought home $295,625 from seven tournaments, almost a quarter percent of the prize pool that year, but his team couldn't get over the hump that year. They got a bunch of second places, some third, but mostly second that year, still being extremely dominant. And in 2023, as of so far, Simp has earned $50,000 from one tournament and gained 3.59% of the total prize money this year. They won Stage Major 2. We'll see what they can do with Stage Major 3. Let me know in the comments if you guys are at the event how it's going. With that being said, Simp's online earnings are at $394,453.33 and his land earnings are at $998,625, bringing his total earnings in his career right now from his tournaments to one million three hundred ninety three thousand seventy eight dollars and thirty three cents he is fourth all time in the console earnings list top 100 highest year being black ops cold war where they won the chip moving on to optic scumpy the king we're only going to be doing scumps land earnings doing his online as well would take us ages man's a king he's, he's winning things in war zone in 2011 scump earned eight thousand three hundred dollars from six tournaments and that was 0.7 percent of the total prize money earned and he got first place in two events and black ops played that game i'm an og 2012 he earned $6,184 from seven tournaments, and that was 0.5% of the total prize money earned. First place, multiple events, all on land. Playing Mono for three that year, one of his best years as well. In 2013, Scump earned $34,825 from five tournaments, and that was 2.94% of total prize money earned. Not bringing home any first places that year in Black Ops 2, but bringing home a bag. 34 grand playing video games was pretty good salary. In 2014, from five tournaments, Scump brought home $36,000, 3.03% of total prize money earned. And Call of Duty Ghost, another decent year for the king. In 2015, Gump brought home $89,000 from 14 tournaments, and that was 7.5% of total prize money earned. Nine event wins, and the highest was MLG World Finals. Mans was most likely absolutely crying, and they earned $25,000 that event. What a bag. In 2016, Scump earned $65,539.38 from nine tournaments, and 5.52% of total prize money earned. They were playing Black Ops 3 that year. Another great year for the king. Five event wins. 2017, $267,250 from eight tournaments. 22 2.5% of that was the prize pool that year, so almost a quarter of the prize pool, bringing home the CWL championship, 150 bags, bro, one of these days. In 2018, Scump brought home 69,875 bucks from seven tournaments, 5.89% of the prize pool. Biggest earnings was in Black Ops 4 that year, even though for the majority of the year, they played World War II after they got off that game, you know, until they started winning. 2019, he brought home 76,625 from six tournaments, playing Black Ops 4 that year. Biggest bag that year was 28,000 at the championship, even though they didn't take home first. 2020, he's earned 12000 from two tournaments, and that was 1% of the total prize pool. 2021, Scump earned 48750 bucks from three tournaments, and that was 4.1% of the total prize money. They were playing Cold War that year. Great game, in my opinion. Great year as well for COD. And in 2020, Scump earned 115000 from six tournaments, almost 10% of the total prize pool, bringing home their home major for 50 bangers that year in Vanguard.
card. We'll see if they can go home the major championship this Sunday when this video goes up on to the total of the King. How much has the King made in his career? Let's find out. If you add those numbers up, land, you will get $829,348.68. Those numbers together equals $1,186,504. Smackaroos from the King, Optic Scumpy Abner, otherwise known as Optic Scumper Jumper, otherwise known as Optic Scumpy, otherwise known as Scump, otherwise known as Envy Scumpy, otherwise known as Optic Scumpa, otherwise known as Optic Scrumper. The King sits at number six on the list at $1,186,505.35. We're like a couple dollars off, not even a dollar. Last but not least, moving on to Tyler Ferris, AKA Faze of Beezy, AKA Abe. So in 2018 online, Abe got $100 from one tournament, actually our lowest earnings of the day. That was 0.01% of the total prize pool that year, playing Black Ops 4, which hey, he got some money playing video games, you know? Not a lot of people can say that that year, especially back then. In 2018 on land, he earned $15,125 from two tournaments, and that was 1% of the total prize pool that year. 2019 online, he earned $500 from one tournament, and on land, $300. $109,614 from seven tournaments, and that was 20% of the total prize pool that year. He also brought home a championship. That year, he got four first places, and his highest earnings was the CWO championship, bringing home $160,000. In 2020, online, he earned $231,025.01 from 17 tournaments. That was 16.13% of the total prize pool. Three first places online, but on land in 2020, he brought home $12,000 from two tournaments, and that was 0.8% of the total prize pool, so not even one. 2021 online, he got $163,416.67 from nine tournaments. That was 11% of the total prize for that year. Multiple first places online, on land, where it matters, $352,500 from three tournaments. That was 24.61% of the total prize money earned, bringing home another championship in Cold War. Also a very dominant year for the BZ because he won that base team that year. 2022 online, he got $2,500 from one tournament, and that was 0.1% percent of the total prize pool but online that year they got 295,625 from seven tournaments and that was 20.64 percent of the total prize pool and land this year they have brought home fifty thousand dollars from one tournament the stage two major five percent of the total prize pool and so with that being said abe has earned in his career one million four hundred thirty two thousand four hundred and five dollars and sixty eight cents but if you break that down online three hundred ninety seven thousand five hundred and forty one dollars and sixty eight cents and on land that's one million thirty four thousand eight hundred and sixty four dollars and these are some big numbers and it's because these people are professionals my name is nico tart subscribe so you don't miss my next call of duty esports breakdown